So yeah, Albion are up to seventh now in the Premier League after their uh, third win in four. They beat Watford 3-1 at the Hawthorns at the weekend. And after the game, uh, Tony Pulis was speaking about January. Obviously January just a month away now, around the corner. And he said, uh, Albion will need to buy quality or buy nothing. Uh, he has been speaking to the board uh, last week about potential targets. But uh, Albion are only going to get one or two new signings in, in, in January. And that's if they get any, uh, Tony said, if those, those quality signings aren't there. Albion don't. Albion won't be buying anybody, and it, at the moment, it doesn't look like they need anyone really. Um, you know, Albion have got ten points from the last twelve. They're shooting right at the table. They might get that top half finish that has eluded Pulis uh, so far. Inside the paper, you can read what Darren Fletcher had to say about uh, James Morrison and Chris Brunt. He said that those getting those two players back from injury is like having two new signings in the team, and I'd have to agree. You know, since they've come back, they've revolutionised the team. I've been playing much more on the front foot, uh, passing the ball forward, and they look much more threatening from uh, from open play. And they've scored a hatful of goals as well at the Hawthorns recently. It does mean that Albion will go into the FA Cup uh, in January uh, in a good in a good position in the league, and hopefully looking to uh, capitalise on that. The draw for the third round is tonight at seven o'clock, so make sure you stay tuned uh, to the Express and Star website uh, for that one. One final thing from Saturday's game is that, unfortunately, uh, we've had the sad news that uh, a Watford fan, a lifelong Watford fan, who collapsed at the train station uh, after the game has now passed away.